The hard work and the struggle that you face now is the main ingredient for who you'll become tomorrow. How can we appreciate success and happiness if we've never had pain? Every single struggle makes you better. All the tough times make you stronger. Every time you get knocked down, it lets you climb a little higher next time. What are you going to do when you go through pain? Because how pain changes you is up to you. We all experience pain. My challenge to you is to not just go through pain, but grow through it. Pain is there to make you better. Without struggle, there can be no victory. And let me tell you, when you've been through pain, when you've fought for where you are, you ain't going to let anyone take away what you've got. When you've earned it and paid your dues and suffered and failed, been hurt and been down, and you get back up. When pain and struggle comes to face you again, you look it in the face and stand it down. Because you've been through too much. You're too strong now. Everything that has happened to you up until this point has made you who you are. And it will continue to mold you into who you will be. All pain, all the sacrifice, all the heartache, all the criticism is always going to be there. But you've got to go through it. You've got to go out and you've got to make moves to make change. Believe you can. Tell yourself you're the person you want to be. And even though from an outside perspective you ain't, just believe it. This will fill you with confidence and you'll start carrying yourself differently. You'll start looking at the world differently. You'll start talking differently, walking differently. Because you ain't no longer the person you are. You're the person you've always wanted to be. But you've got to believe in you. So believe. I'm going to lose weight. I'm going to get a new job. I'm going to spend more time with my family. I'm going to stop smoking. I'm going to stop drinking. I'm going to leave this abusive relationship. So why is it, come February, we're back doing the same old shit, making the same mistakes, hanging around with the same old people, doing the same bad habits, making the same excuses? This happens every single year, and I'm telling you now, if you don't want to fall into the same old trap that you do every year, then you need to change something else before all that other shit that you put on your resolution list. You need to change your mind. You need to change the way you think, the way you look at the world, the way you look at problems. You've got to change what you believe is possible. Without the correct mindset and belief about what you're capable of or what you will have, you'll have no chance of following through on any of your New Year's resolutions. This year will be the same as last year if you don't change your mind. This will be your year. Don't let what's happened to you up until this point define what happens from this point on. All the shit that you've been through in life, all the pain, all the darkness. You have the power to change it from this day forward, but you have to change your mind. Let this be the year where you get up off the ground, out the dirt. Let this be the year that you get the passion for life that you've never had before. A year like no other, but a new year means nothing without a new mind. If you always do what you've always done, you'll always get what you've always got. If you've still got that shit in your head, you're going to have shit in your life. If you've still got that hate in your mind, you're still going to have hate in your life. All that's going to be different is you're going to have a new calendar to work on all that hate and shit that you did last year. You're still going to be lazy. You're still going to be hateful. You're still going to be fat. You're still going to be jealous. You're still going to be insecure. You're still going to be hating on people. But if you say without a shadow of a doubt, then that's it. I'm done. I'm going to change because I have to. Because life depends on it. When that clock strikes 12, you'll make the change and stick to it. This is your year. All you've got to do is get in the right frame of mind. 
This is your year to get healthy. This is your year to meet that person of your dreams. This is your year to get in shape. Your year to go further in your career. Your year to break free from depression. This is your year to chase your dreams. Change the way you think. And this year, you'll transform the rest of your life. What's your greatest fear? Fear is a part of life. It's a constant. Just like the air you breathe or the beat of your heart, it's always going to be there. Like a big shadow following you around every time you want to try something new. Start a new job, meet new people, it's going to be there. Whispering in your ear, lying to you about what might happen if you do this new thing. The question is, are you going to let it control you or are you going to control it? Because let me tell you, if you don't keep fear in check, it will consume you. It will slowly but surely start breaking you down piece by piece, stripping away everything that's good inside you. All the imagination, all the adventure, spontaneity, all the stuff that was inside you as a kid will be buried in the shadow of fear. Don't let it. Don't let the fear of failing or f***ing up stop you from being who you want to be. Doing what you want to do. Seeing what you want to see. Just do it, man. You will cry. There's some stuff that will happen in your life that will make you cry. It's okay. It's a part of the deal. If you can't handle pain, you don't want success. You got to look at life when life knocks you down and says, this all you got? Is this it? I was born in the dark, shaped in the dark, molded by the dark. I will break you. You recycle your pain. You use your pain. And some of you are not successful because every single time you run up against a trial, every time you run up against a tribulation, you stop. And what I'm here to tell you is, if you tell that thing, I'm here just like you here, and I promise you, I ain't leaving without the degree. I will not leave without that goal. I will not leave without that dream. I will not leave this university until I'm successful. I will not leave this job. I will not leave this client. I will not leave this opportunity until I get it. And you're going to have to fight and fight and fight and fight. And most of you won't be successful, not because you can't do it, but you can't outlast your old you to get to your new you. You must have patience and engage in consistent action. Look at your belief system every single day and stick with it. Don't rush the process, trust the process. Don't rush the process, trust the process. Don't rush the process, trust the process. Everybody dreams of greatness. Everybody wants to be great. Everybody dreams of greatness, wishes to be great, talks about great, idolize the great. Everybody wants to be great, but only a few when that moment presents itself. Only a few when that time has come. Only a few are willing to step up to the moment and actually execute. When you're dealing with another human being, it's not how tall he is. When you're dealing with another human being, it's not how big he is. When you're dealing with another human being, it's not how strong he is. At the end of the day, it comes down to will. Your dreams count on you, push. Anybody want to give you no cookies and ice cream? Push. It's a lie. It's inside. How do you know you feel it? You dream about it. You eat and sleep it every day. When people talk to you, tell them, this is what I'm going to do. So push. Just push past the fight. Push. Don't quit. Don't get Push. Push your way to success. It's going to rain sometimes. I will. will. You're going to feel discouraged sometimes. I will. will. No matter what the obstacle, I will. will. I must. must. Live extreme and push your boundaries. Why? Simply because there will be no other time for you to do this. You can dream of these things, but understand you can also achieve them. The moments that take your breath away are the ones that count. I don't care if you've been beaten to the floor, if your legs are too tired to lift that weight. Break through that barrier and create new ones for you. When there's a will, there's a way. When you truly need something, you can find a way and you stop at nothing to reach it. The inches we need are everywhere around us. They're in every break of the game, every minute, every second. In any fight, it's the guy who's willing to die who's going to win that inch. It's not easy reaching your goal. It's not easy changing your life. It's not easy trying to build a business and people are negative and saying no every day. It takes a lot of guts. 
Bill collectors are calling and your phone might be cut off. You might lose your job. It takes a lot of guts. You don't have nothing but lint in the corner of your pocket. You're out here talking about living your dream. And people laughing at you. And they're doubting you. But let me tell you, I believe in revenge like Frank Sinatra. He said the best revenge is massive success. It takes guts. You got to dig down deep to gut it out. Keep on going again and again and again. It's hard. No, easy is not an option. However, ladies and gentlemen, what you will discover is that it's worth it.